Hello everybody. Uh, today in our handstand progression, we are getting away from supporting yourself while sitting down on your hands and now we're starting to invert your body. So we're going to begin challenging not only just the pressure on your hands and your wrists and your elbows and your shoulders, but we're also doing it in more challenging positions now. So it's a little bit easier to stay sturdy when my hands are down by my side, but once I start to invert my body, those arms have to get away from your midsection and it's harder to pin them in. So we're going to start the crow pose with your feet on this little pad thing. So any sort of block, six inches or so, the, the pillows are actually kind of challenging. I've tried them already because they are soft and they compress. But if you can find something a little firmer, it'll be a little easier for you. So we are going to start just with your feet where you want them your hands closer than you think they need to be, and your knees on the ground. And from here, I'm gonna first kind of pull my belly button back toward my spine just to give my hips the stability that they need. And from there, I'm gonna pick my knees up off the ground, make sure my head stays long not crunched forward like this. I stay long like this. Keeps my shoulder and my neck in a good position here. <clears throat> so yes, where were we? Neck is long, belly button is back, and I pick my knees up. And then from here, I'm gonna keep our feet on the block, elevated, and we're just gonna bring our knees into our arms wherever feels comfortable, wherever they want to go. And you just hold here. Try to make sure your head isn't falling toward the ground like that. Try to make sure your neck stays long. And just see if you can breathe. And gently set yourself down. So that is a crow pose with your feet on the block. Now, if you tried that one, you know that the forces are a lot higher here. So this is starting to become more and more challenging. You're going to start seeing me sweating more and more in these videos. Um, but that is the first step in that little mini progression in our handstand preparation progression.